Hi guys, it's Shani from Yanomai's. And today, we're wrapping a car from Six Underground. See ya. So this car wasn't always green. Let me take you back 24 hours. I reckon nothing is. Today we have this Alfa Romeo. It's 502 brake horsepower. It's a V6 twin turbo. Is that right? That's what Terry just told me. Stats. Have you seen the movie Six Underground? We're gonna wrap this car in lime green so it looks exactly like the one from the movie. I hope you enjoy this video. Hey guys, it's Mark. Let's wrap this bad boy. Okay, so behind me we've got the Alfa Romeo Giulia. You can see the boys have already started wrapping it. It looks like a normal saloon car, but it's actually packs a bit of a punch. It's got a 2.9 litre V6 twin turbo. It's 0 to 60 time is around 3.9 seconds. So yeah, a bit like an M3 in the BMW range, but these really pack a punch and they're real wheel drive, so a lot of fun. So yeah, over to the boys wrapping it up. favorite car movie of all time is probably going to be Too Fast, Too Furious. It's changed now, but back then it was all about the street racing stuff. I, I found that movie sick. Like, that's what got me into cars as well. I think my favorite line is probably where Ludacris said to everyone to back up and they get turned into barbecue. Favorite car film is definitely Death Race. I forgot about that one until Chris mentioned it. There is a favorite scene. The whole thing's just good, isn't it? What Death Race? A lot of killing in that one, though. Not for your under 16s. I'm gonna have to say Fast and Furious 1. Different era back there. Nowadays he's like jumping buildings and stuff. But I'd say favorite car scene would probably be too Fast and Furious. The way he wins the race, just looking straight at Eva Mendes, the way he just pulls that handbrake. Yeah, favorite scene, definitely. Ah, oh, there's too many. Probably Bullet. I think Bullet. Obviously there's Bad Boys, which is probably everyone's favorite. But I'm a bit older than all these lot, so I'm gonna say Cannibal Run first one, right at the beginning where the black Lamborghini is getting away from the police car. It's always been my favorite. But a couple of weeks ago, I watched Six Underground and the first 10 minutes of the film is probably up there with one of the best car chases. The guy's drifting around, dodging babies and puppies and all sorts. Go and watch the film if you ain't seen it. Really good car scene. Hey guys, it's Naomi. I'm gonna wrap the doors. Favourite film was the um, Tokyo Drip and my favourite scene was when they were on the street and they started drifting and then all the people in the middle started spread out. It was sick. So my favourite car film stroke scene is a film called Ronin. If you've not seen it, go and watch that film. Robert De Niro, Chase, I think it's around Paris or something or other, um, but they're in normal cars and some of the driving skills in it are really, really good and it's probably, what, 10 minutes, 15 minutes worth of chasing, but yeah, awesome, go check it out. Favourite car scene has to be from the original Bad Boys, Porsche versus the AC Cobra. It's a great scene and that obviously finishes up with Will Smith saying to Martin Lawrence, now that's how you drive, from now on, that's how you drive. There's so many. Um, Smoking the Bandit for the older generation, Back to the Future, James Bond with the Lotus Esprit where it went in the water, Bad Boys 1 with the Porsche 911 Turbo, that's with the Frog Eye, that's a bad boy car. Bad Boys 2 with the Ferrari um, and the boat, I'm not a fan of the Ferrari but that was also a great movie. I don't even know, comment down below. What is your favourite car movie and favourite car? Pass. I've got too many, too many, I don't know what to do. 
So that is Nick from Thames Motor Group and he's gonna give you a little bit more information about this beauty. So we're in Alfa Romeo main dealer and this is the top spec car we have. It's just over 500 horsepower. Compared to the other models, this is the most powerful one we've got. It blows everything out of the water really. Everyone that drives it loves it and it's been a really great model for us. So this car is going to be in our showroom at Tunbridge Wells, so it's for sale. If there's anything you'd like to know about the car or you'd like to buy it from us, just get in touch, all the details are below. So there it is guys, the Alfa Romeo Giulia Quadrifoglio. It looks amazing. Yes, it's exactly like the car from Six Underground. If you've seen that film, you'll actually appreciate this car a lot more. Thank you so much for watching guys. Make sure you give it a thumbs up if you like this video and I'll see you soon, take care.